What's up guys? Taking the content on the road and today we are in the land of Sephora. So we're heading to Sephora to check out some items. So come along with me. in our Sephora haul. So let's start with the first Aid Beauty KP Bump Eraser Body Scrub. I've used this in the past and I stopped using it for some reason. Um, I had picked up the Dove but I really do enjoy this and I do notice that there is a bigger difference in my skin when I use this. I'm back to using it and I wanted to just get the bigger bottle so it lasts me a while. And then I got my Ever Faithful Paula's Choice and again in a bigger bottle I usually get the smaller size that runs me about $13 this was I believe 35 and just to show you how big it is I thought it would be bigger but it's pretty big compared to the smaller one and then in here oh great i think in a previous video i told you guys how much i love this moisture cream from youth to the people and i had to get the full size because i've been getting the sample size i probably should show you what you guys what this looks like from the inside but um i'll do that in a sec let's just run through everything here so what I'm very, very excited about is the perfumes I got today. So this is, I think, the original Valentino Donna born in Roma. Um, I don't remember the scent that this is in, but it smells delightfully fresh. And this is the 1.7 fluid ounce. And we're going to be smelling great for work when I get back. And... When I'm not at work, or when there's something more interesting going on, I got the Chloe, which is a eau de parfum, and it is meant to be a warm floral scent, and it smells delicious. I could not pass this up when the sales associate shared it with me. It was so good. And then I have two things in here that I've been eyeing forever. This Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm in Hot Chocolate. It is delightful on the lips. I've already tried it and I put it back in the box, but I couldn't resist. And I'm so happy that I have this. And I am very much a lip gloss girl. So this is adding to my collection very well then I think this might be the last item now this is the Fenty Icon Velvet Liquid Lipstick in MVP I haven't tried this I'm eager to try it I think every girl should have a good red lipstick in her artillery and so I got this one because it's Fenty, so I'm expecting nothing but greatness. And you guys can look out for a full-on review on this. But I'm excited to try it and see what this looks like on my skin. So that, that basically is my haul of what I got at Sephora. 